Hello Facebook! Hi everybody, Jamie here. It is Monday, December 20th. A few more days till Christmas, so five more days until Christmas. I hope everybody is having an awesome week. Uh, we or had an awesome weekend and, and had a nice start to the week. It is Monday, December 20th, so hopefully everybody is doing well. Um, you had a good weekend, everybody's happy, healthy, um, and ready for the holidays. The holidays will be here before we know it. Christmas Eve is on Friday night, the 24th. Uh, Aroma Time is open from 4 to 10 p.m. We're opening a little bit earlier, so if you want to stop in and have a drink, have an appetizer, or just uh, come for dinner. We are open all night on Friday night. Saturday is Christmas Day, we are closed. We are a soup kitchen on Christmas Day. This will be our 19th soup kitchen. Um, if you are out there and you are baking this week or you have extra cookies and you'd like to share them, a pie, a cake, anything uh, with us, that would be great. We'd love to give um, homemade desserts to our um, our to our deliveries, uh, the people that are receiving the meals, the people that are in need of meals. It's a lot, you know, not only is it people that are in need because financially need, but it's also people that are in need because they don't have family around and they're only cooking for one person and it's nice to just get a nice cooked meal by somebody else for the holidays. So we deliver to a lot of senior centers and um, we deliver to uh, a lot of families. And uh, so right now we have probably about 200 people we'll be delivering to, um, and that is on Christmas Day. We are looking for donations of baked goods. Those can be dropped off anytime from tomorrow until uh, Saturday morning or Friday evening, whichever works better for you. So if you are baking and you want to give your kids something to do and you want to give um, give a little bit, uh, Aroma Time is accepting donations of baked goods. So I don't see anybody joining. I see some people now. If you are watching me live, you can put hashtag live in the comments. If you are watching on the replay, put hashtag replay. Give me a thumbs up so that I know that you are here. Um, today I'm going to be making an orange eggnog cream uh, drink. So I this week I will be making lots of drinks um, that you can share with your families um, over the holidays. And um, hopefully some of you will be making some of my drinks at home. And if you do, I'd love to hear about them. I'd love for you to send me some pictures. I'd love for you to share some of your drinks. Send me pictures of the drinks you are making. Maybe you have found some different recipes or you've worked hard one day. So, well, let's see. A little housekeeping before we, um, before I make my drink. Our $9.99 special takeout this week is our uh, pizza. It's our brisket pizza that is available for takeout. Our regular menu is available as well. I always say that. Uh, we uh, are looking at maybe doing New Year's Eve boxes uh, for New Year's Eve, so stay tuned for that. We're working on some details. Hopefully we'll have that um, set by, uh, by Wednesday or so. And um, if not, we are available for takeout, so you can come and take out at any time. Order off of our regular menu, and um, you can come and pick it up. So, um, or we can deliver it out to your car, whichever is easiest for you. So I appreciate everybody joining me. Hello, Jennifer. Hello, Victor. Thank you all so much for watching me. Um, I am so appreciative. I've been doing these for, gosh, it'll be two years in March um, already. I can't believe I've been uh, doing these Facebook Lives for two years. They are fun. They're awesome. Um, and Marcus and I also do a lot of other uh, email, uh, Facebook, uh, Facebook Lives as well. We do a lot of educational things. We do a lot of wine things. We do a lot when we're traveling. And of course, I do this time so um, hopefully you guys are getting some stuff out of it hopefully you're taking some of my drinks and creating them and making them at home but today I'm going to be making a orange eggnog cream I'm going to be using Ronnie Brook um, eggnog um, and you know one of the things that I'm going to be working on as one of my goals for the new year is if you have a company and you'd like me to uh, if you'd like to sponsor one of my drinks and you want to send me some product um, I would be happy to uh, promote you and use your products on my Facebook Live. So um, that would be fun for me. I really enjoy that. But in the meantime, I'm using as much local as possible. Behind the bar, all independent spirits um, that we have um, from all local companies. This is one of them, Ronnie Brook Eggnog. It is um, local, uh, locally made eggnog. So I am going to start with um, some Curacao. So I'm going to put two ounces of Curacao. Going to add some eggnog. You know, you can make this as um, heavy 
be or as light as you like the loaf spend. Thank you very much for joining me. So about two ounces of eggnog. I am going to add a little Madagascar vanilla. Um, super expensive, but really great. You can use vanilla extract if you have um, use an organic vanilla extract. And I am going to um, take my hydro plate and some nutmeg and I'm going to shave some nutmeg into my drink. Watching. Hello, somebody say welcome back. Thank you. I was away. I hadn't been on for a week or so. So I am glad to be back. I'm glad to be bringing you drinks homemade by Jamie. I'm going to uh, take a As most of you know, I like my drinks on the rocks. But this one I should just uh, leave like this. I'm going to put a little bit of nutmeg to use my grater and just grate a little bit. The whole nutmeg fell in there. No. <laughs> I gotta get my nutmeg out. Oh, it's spilling. <laughs> That's so funny. <laughs> Let's try that again. So I'm trying to do it with the wrong hand so you can see it. Um, just grate a little bit of nutmeg on top there. If you haven't uh, been on my Facebook Lives lately, I've been talking about the fact that I want to garnish a little bit more. But I only have, um, I only have uh, blood oranges, so I'm gonna put a little blood orange peel on top. I'm just going to squeeze it on top here. And I'm going to twist it and to, yeah, I'm going to put some rocks in here. And then I'm going to put my orange peel just right on top, just like that. So let's go ahead and taste it. It's like a, it's like a uh, creamsicle. It is so good. So eggnog. If you're out there and you find some eggnog on the shelves, Ronnie Brook eggnog, awesome. You can dial it up a little bit. You can put rum in it. You can put more nutmeg and um, and some cinnamon. Some clove could even be added. Some vanilla and uh, dial it up with a little bit of rum, a little orange curacao. Mm. That is yummy. Wow. Delicious drink. Um, anyway, thank you everybody for watching there. I appreciate it. Hello, Sean. Hello, hello everybody. A lot, um, a lot of viewers joining me, so I appreciate it. Thank you very much. And um, I will be back tomorrow on Around All Week, so hopefully I'll be back tomorrow bringing another cocktail to you for the holidays. Hope everybody has a great Monday night, and I will catch you all tomorrow. Have a good night. Cheers.